the archaeological method on ancient Assyria. Background research. finding background research on the Assyrians. This is the process in which our team gains as much information about our topic, Assyria, as we can before we did. We ask, where are we going? What do we need to bring, and what are we looking for? We found that the Assyrians were cruel and used weapons like axes, arrows, and swords, etc. Now that we found our information, it is time to move to our next step, the excavation process. The excavation process. As you can see, our group is working on digging up artifacts in the excavation process. During this, we made sure everyone had a clear defined role so everyone knew what they were supposed to do. We also made sure that there were no pipes and that we had perm and to make sure that we have a safe dig. If everyone knows what we're supposed to do and to be safe, then our dig will be successful. We had a very successful dig. We found a dagger, a club, a spear, a shield, a sword, a bow and arrow, and an axe. Analysis of findings. Dug up our artifacts, we have to make an analysis of our findings. For every hour we spend digging, we spend 10 hours of it in the lab. This is when we take our artifacts, bow and arrow, dagger, sword, axe, spear, battering, ram, shield, and club and axe. What is it? What is its purpose? And how old is it? What is it made for? And what did it? And did they trade it or did they make it? We found in most cases that the Assyrians made their own weapons. The bow and arrow, dagger, sword, axe, battering ram, spear, and club were used in battle for attacking purposes, and the shield was used for protection. Most weapons used by the Assyrians were made of wood, but in the cases of the sword, dagger, and shield, they were made of iron. All the weapons the Assyrians used were made around the time period of 500 and 600 BCE. Publication. Welcome back with two archaeologists, Michael and Danny. I understand you just got back from a big dig. What are you doing right now? We are doing the fourth step of the archaeological method, publication. We put all our information about our findings in one spot so people all around the world can learn about it. I see you. I see you got something with you. We chose to make a book about our finding of the spear. We do this so we can get credit for our finding and people all around the world can get an in-depth look of our, our um, uh, finding of the spear. And also we create a written record for future uh, archaeological. Preservation. In this step, we preserve our artifacts for the future reference. As you can see, uh, my team is put delicately placing the artifacts in the preservation lab in an oxygen-reduced environment. We do this so we can look back on the artifacts for future reference. So when more advanced technology comes out, we can gain a better perspective on the Assyrians. The Winnie the Poos. Background research, Hank W. Excavation process, Devin V. Analysis of findings, Libby L. Publication, Michael S. Preservation, Brenly A.